I looked at Warren's face and his eyes, and Warren's, it was almost like Warren was speaking to me, say, Mommy, I just said to Craig as he was sitting there, Mommy, don't worry, we are fine. And it's almost like his eyes is, is like following us everywhere. Um, I met Arlen about, I think about 13 years ago, and Arlen became a daughter to me. Um, actually, more like a friend. Because I remembered one night I said to her, Morris with my face, I started with a baseball bit. She says, if I try it, let's try it. That was the relationship we had. And today, I want, just want to make a promise to Arlene and Warren, in front of all of you, Gabby and Wade is my responsibility, it's our responsibility today. There's a long road ahead of us, and um, it's gonna be a difficult road. But I believe through the grace of God, we are going to turn all our trials, all of our trials will turn into stepping stones. And there's such a lot of gossip and, um, and stories going around. All I ask of you people is to respect us as a family. Give us a time to mourn, give us a time to grieve. And we appreciate each and every handshake, phone call, flowers, messages of condolences. We really, as a family, we do appreciate that. One thing you would notice when visiting Arlene and Warren, even during the week, was all these papers that would be laid out on the table, and the laptops would be open, and either Arlene or Warren or both of them would be at that dinner table working. We were both studying or busy completing a task, it is what I admire the most about them. How they continuously chose to improve themselves and each other and ensured a better life for their kids.